Hi everyone, I hope you're all well. Welcome back to my channel. And today I am coming at you from New York, which is very exciting. I'm in my hotel room and I wanted to film this video here because it's gonna be my top travel essentials, the things that I like to bring with me when I travel. I really enjoy watching videos like this, so I thought you guys would too. And this video is sponsored by Bose, which I'm over the moon about. I can't wait to tell you guys about one of their new products, so I will get to that in a little bit. But I've got all my kind of travel essentials laid out around me on the bed now so i'm going to talk through them one by one and i'll also link below in the description box everything that i'm talking about if you want to check them out okay in no particular order i'm just going to grab stuff comfy bottoms comfy like tracksuit bottoms are so important you can wear them on the plane you can sleep in them i'm wearing these as pajamas while i'm here also if you're just kind of lounging around in the hotel room these are very important to me these are the uniqlo i think they're called the super stretch which just sounds amazing they are as amazing as they sound um i saw alex from the frugality talk about these and they are so good they are super stretchy they're really soft and comfortable i like how they don't they're not tight around the ankle they're just so comfortable i need to buy like two more pairs of these because i'm wearing them all the time and i don't want to wash them because i'll be sad not to wear them so comfy bottoms that is my first essential. Okay, my second one, this is maybe a little bit random, but a spare tote bag. These always come in so handy when I'm traveling, whether I use it um, for my dirty washing, because there's never anywhere to put that, and I hate putting it in my like main case. So dirty washing, or if you buy stuff and you need like a bag, or if you're like going shopping whilst you're away and you wanna have like a reusable bag, this one um, is from Lulu Guinness. It's very clever because it just looks like lips and you like unzip it and it turns into a whole bag. Actually, should I show you? Look, it unzips all the way around. I think I got this from like this, the village. It becomes a quite big tote bag. Very, very clever. A normal tote bag will obviously do the trick. As well as a spare tote bag, especially when I'm coming to America, especially when I'm coming to New York, I tend to bring with me a spare toiletry bag. Um, that's normally because I end up buying a lot of stuff in Sephora and there's never enough room to like bring it back and I don't want it to just be like loose in my suitcase. So I always bring a spare bag with me and I can put them all in there. Although I haven't bought that much yet on this trip, but this always comes in handy. I always feel like I end up coming back with more toiletries than I went with and just bits that I buy and extra stuff. It just makes packing a lot easier. This one is from Liberty. It was part of like a mummy to be or something set that was really nice actually. And it's a really good size. I love it when they kind of open really wide on the sides. You can like fit loads in there. Okay, now this next item I'm very excited to chat to you guys about. They are the Bose Sleep Buds. Now Bose sent me these to try and I totally fell in love with them. So I really wanted to tell you guys about them. They're a very clever new product. So I've got them in this little pouch. Let me open it up and show you. Just looks like this, very smart. And then look, ooh, how cool is that? These are the little sleep buds. If you haven't yet heard of these, they are perfect if you struggle to sleep, which at the moment is definitely me. With the whole pregnancy thing, I struggle to sleep. But also if you've got a snoring partner, if you live on like a busy road with cars driving around outside, or if you're traveling and you struggle to sleep in your hotel room, jet lag, you know, there's so many different things that could prevent you from having a good night's sleep. They're very clever, so they're noise masking, and they also connect to an app on your phone that plays you really soothing, like sleep-inducing sounds, like the swish of the ocean. Oh my God, that's my favorite one. I absolutely love it. And what's also very clever is that you can set your own alarm. So when you're wearing these, your alarm can go off and it won't wake up your partner who's sleeping next to you, which I actually think is a genius feature. So let me show you, they come in this charging case, which is perfect for travel, but also just great for keeping on your bedside table. And they are super comfortable. So let me show you, They're very little and they just slot into your ear. And they're designed for people who sleep on their sides and who toss and turn in their sleep, which is definitely me. I can never decide, which gets so annoyed. I like toss from one side to the other. So they're really, really comfortable and you can't notice them at all when you're sleeping. Like I'm the sort of person that would get really annoyed by that and I just find them so comfortable to wear. So they fit perfectly in your ear and then you can store them in there when you're not using them. I've been using these almost every night when I'm at home because I've really been struggling to like fall asleep at the moment, but also our bedroom's at the front of the house. So it's really been helping kind of masking any noises from outside. But also I brought them with me on this trip because you know, Amir in a hotel room, we asked for a quiet room because I'm like really boring and pregnant at the moment. But even with that, you know, there's like city life outside. You never know if you're gonna hear other things in the hotel. So 
these have been amazing to have with me on the trip so if you want to learn more about the bose sleep buds i will put a link down below in the description box i'm so happy and excited to have my own pair so thank you so much to bose and i'm very excited to be telling you guys about these products if you have any questions about them please leave me a comment down below I just think they are super cool. On to my next travel essential, and this is a new one for me. Um, it's a water bottle. It's from One Green Bottle. And I had quite a specific requirement of what I wanted in a water bottle. I wanted one with like a sucky straw, so you don't have to like tilt it if you're lying in bed or lying on the sofa, which I'm doing a lot of at the moment. But a lot of the ones that have a sucky straw are made out of like plastic that aren't great for you. Um, and it's very confusing information online on which plastics are okay and which ones aren't. Anyway, I just didn't really want a plastic one. So this one is, what is this like? Rich, what's this called? Stainless steel, it says. This one is made out of stainless steel, so when it's empty, it's super light. Um, this is the, oh, it doesn't say, but this is the smallest size. I'll link it down below. And I love it. I love it so much that I almost lost it, and I immediately ordered a new one online. So I'm very happy with this. I brought it with me to New York so I can keep it in Rich's backpack all day, and I'll never get thirsty. I'm trying to be good and drink a lot more water at the moment. So that's that. Talking about backpacks, actually, I got a new one for this trip because I knew I would use it like loads of times again. I only had one that was from Whistles and it's like a leather one and it wasn't right for this trip. So um, in the end, I got one of these online. I'm not gonna be able to pronounce this. Falraven Kanken. I don't know, I think it's like a Scandinavian brand, but these are very popular. Everyone raves about them. So I got this one. I'm not exactly sure what the color is, but I'll link it down below. And it looked really small when it came, but everyone was like, try it because you can actually fit so much in. The zips go all the way down to the sides, so it's really easy to open. And there's a little slot at the back um, if you travel with a laptop. And yeah, I'm really, really happy with it. It fitted so much in for the plane and I can use it whilst I'm here. Although I've been making Rich carry his backpack most days, but this is a really good one. So this is gonna be like a travel essential forever for me. And then also in there um, is my travel pillow. This is a memory soft one that I got online. I'll link it below. So it's made out of like memory foam, which is just life changing. I used to have one of these like neck pillows and I just never liked it when they've got the little like, be like beans in them. It just wasn't comfy. Whereas these ones are so comfortable. They kind of clip at the front of your neck and then you literally like can't move your head. And so whether you're just like lying on the plane relaxing or even if like in your hotel room you just want to like sit and watch a film it's so comfortable but if you're sleeping it doesn't give you a neck ache so I always kind of travel with this and yeah it's a really good one. These may seem obvious but trainers especially for like a trip to New York comfy shoes these are my Nike internationalists which I got from and other stories I don't want to put them too close to my face because they've been outside but these are my favorite trainers at the moment they are so comfortable I can't even tell you I would highly highly recommend them if you're in the market for a new pair of trainers um, these are the blue ones I have them in like yellow gray I have them in so many colors they're just the best trainers so I'm very thankful to my friend SJ for introducing them to me so that's a bit of an obvious one but I just can't go anywhere without trainers okay let's talk travel beauty I've got some like minis I'm going to talk you through it in a moment but first of all just some like bits that I can't really be without um so this is just a little glossier bag um and in here, I've got a few different things. First of all, this is like a new addition because I've become obsessed with this since getting pregnant. Um, it's the Michelle Rock O'Neill Therapy Restore Aura Spray. And when I was really, really anxious at the beginning, this was just a lifesaver. And now it just kind of reminds me to be calm if I'm feeling a bit like anxious or just if I want something nice and like, just if I wanna like treat myself. It's just a really gorgeous like facial spray. Let me spray a bit. Oh, I love the smell of this so much. It instantly calms me and just makes me feel really like zen. I can't really explain. It's in the most untravel friendly packaging ever. I don't know if she does a travel size, but this is like a huge glass bottle, but I just, I couldn't, I can't be without this. I use it every day. So that definitely was coming with me. Obviously travel flight socks. I used these before I was pregnant, um, obviously because I was on the pill and now I'm pregnant. They're even more important. They just, you know, I put them on before the flight, wear them the whole time. Very important ladies. And the next thing is a hand sanitizer. Handy on the plane, handy when I'm here. I pretty much have these in my handbag all the time when I'm at home as well. My favorite ones are from the body shop and this is the Mango hand cleanse gel these are great for obvious reasons but you never know i always like to keep my hands clean before i eat or anything like that wet wipes self-explanatory and then also some sea sickness bands i normally travel with these 
anyway just in case you never know if i'm going to be in a cab and i'm going to be feeling like travel sickness if i have to get on like a boat randomly which i would always try not to um but also now that i'm pregnant you just never know when like the sickness is going to hit so these are just little bands that have like this little like um white plastic thing that you basically put them on your wrist and they just put a bit of pressure on the points that are meant to help you make you feel less sick now i've used these for years and I don't necessarily know if they always work, if I'm honest, but I do think they can work as kind of like a placebo effect. So just the idea of putting them on sometimes can help my brain make me feel like I'm, I feel less sick. So it, there's no harm, it's not like taking medicine. So I just put those on and carry those with me just in case. I always collect travel minis um, for beauty products for when I'm going away because it's really annoying having to take like full sizes with you and a lot of the products that I use are in like big glass jars that are just really heavy. So actually something I picked up on this trip which I didn't have and I was desperate to, I don't know if they do these at home, I hope they do um, because I only bought one, is a mini of the Clinique Take the Day Off cleansing balm this is my like favorite cleanser at the moment um, it's just fake fragrance free it's a balm it takes off your makeup your eye makeup as well really well so I got a mini of that and the, the full-size version of this I didn't even bring it with me because it's so big so I was really happy to find this here and then I've got a few minis of drunk elephant products and these came in like a Christmas package um, but they also do a mini set as well and again like products I love in minis because what I used to do is I used to just take any old minis with me and then my skin would always get bad when I'm away because I'm not using my favorite products so it's so nice to have the products that I'm using anyway in miniature this one is the intensive hydration serum the blue one this is the C tango eye cream and then this is um, this is actually the whipped cream moisturizer so it's different to the one i use at home but actually now this is making me want to get this one because it's really really nice and like hydrating so how cute are those little minis and then the final thing is something i got in that little kind of liberty gift set it's the bloom and blossom anti-stretch mark cream um i just use this like after i shower and it's really nice actually i think it's got a very nice like calming scent so i'm trying to get good at that whole like stretch mark cream oil thing so those are my top travel essentials they might not be for everyone but those are the things that i have to take with me when i travel there's some new additions and things that i've been traveling with for years so i really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you want to find out more about any of the products i spoke about including the bose sleep buds i will put all the information down below in the description box and thank you so much for watching i'll see you guys in my next video bye